We are going to take a walk down Butte's memory lane now as the mining city boasts history of a black community rich with social clubs, churches, and even a black owned newspaper. MTN's John Amy looks back. Butte's African American population is under 200 people these days, but at the turn of the century, it hosted a much larger population. Historically, earlier on, um, we had uh, uh, early neighborhoods. Uh, that were kind of exclusive uh, to individuals of color throughout our history. At the time, there were two prominently black churches, social clubs, and even a newspaper. Butte was the home of Montana's first full black-owned newspaper. Uh, individuals of color, uh, it was called the Butte New Age. Um, Barb's John Duncan and another guy by the name of Chris Dorsey. This humble little church at Idaho and Platinum Street in Uptown Butte was built in 1901 as an AME church and was frequented by many of Butte's African American community at the turn of the century. They hosted Masonic lodges, women's clubs, literary socials, community dinners, um, you know, for the, uh, uh, for all people, but African Americans, there was a place called the Pearl Club. Fisk adds that Butte can honor Martin Luther King Day by a day of service to your community. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News.